As part of his four-day visit to poll bound to Manipur, NPP National President Conrad Sangma campaigned in a Chura Chandpur district and drummed up support for as many as six candidates who are in the fray from the area. In addressing party workers in a 60 Singhat Assembly constituency amongst others, Sangma stated that the NPP reflects the voice of the people of Northeast. National politics is very complicated. And I don't blame the leaders in Delhi. I don't blame anybody. But when it comes to the Northeast, they don't even uh, know the states and the capitals in some cases. They don't even know that there are multiple tribes in the state of Manipur and multiple communities. They don't know the complications that are there. And there is nobody to give voice to the concerns of our people. Because when we send one MP from uh, Garo Hills or one MP from Khasi Hills or one MP from Mizoram, Delhi does not listen. And it's simple, the reason. Because we are just one MP from the different states. We are just two MPs in some states. And therefore, the National People's Party has a vision to provide the platform for the Northeast to voice our concerns in a powerful manner in Parliament. We will work towards ensuring that we combine and we provide the platform, we get the numbers to be able to be a strong voice when it comes to the Northeast in Parliament and we'll work towards that and it will only happen if the people of the region are united. And once again, the Meghalaya Chief Minister expressed confidence that the NPP will emerge as the single largest party in Manipur. Whether you go to Senapati district, Mao area, Ukrul area, Chura Chanpur, or the valley, we have a great response from different constituencies today where we are putting up more than 43 candidates. And I can assure you that today the kind of response that we are getting, NPP will emerge as the single largest party in Manipur. I am very sure about that. And once we do that, it will be a historic moment for the people of Manipur and for the National People's Party. And well, it needs to be mentioned here that the NPP national president arrived in the state yesterday and released the final list of NPP candidates for the polls. Party tickets were handed out to nine candidates yesterday, including two sitting MLAs, Y. Irabot Singh and M. Rameshwar Singh from Wangke and Kakching constituencies, respectively. The two were denied BJP tickets and had defected to the NPP party since.